All right, welcome back, everybody. So former Democratic presidential candidate and representative of Hawaii says she is done with the Democratic yes. Party. Tulsi Gabbard calls them the elitist cabal, and she wants others to follow her out as well. Yes, Gold, uh, Gabbard, who retired from the House in 2021, made the announcement official earlier today. She did not say if she was joining the Republican Party. Doesn't sound like she is based on what she said. But let's listen to Gabbard and her reasons why she is now leaving the Democratic Party. Now, I'm calling on my fellow common sense, independent minded Democrats to join me in leaving the Democratic Party. If you can no longer stomach the direction that the so called woke Democratic Party ideologues are taking our country, then I invite you to join me. So not a huge surprise. Uh, it was 2019 during the Democratic presidential debate where she, uh, you know, shared the stage. She was with Joe Biden, Kamala Harris standing right there. And she did blast the Democratic establishment even back then. Our Democratic Party, unfortunately, is not the party that is of, by, and for the people. It's a par it is a party that has been and continues to be influenced by the foreign policy establishment in Washington, represented by Hillary Clinton and others' foreign policy, by the military-industrial complex and other greedy corporate interests. Hard to believe that was three years ago, yeah. right? Wow. Time flies. Let's welcome in our guest to talk more about this, Democratic campaign strategist and former Obama campaign director, Robin Biro. Great to have you with us, Robin. Good to be with you. Thank you. Hopefully we'll get Jesse Jane back with us in just a moment. I mean, this is a new take on Tulsi's 2019 riff there when she was running for president as Democrat. Is there anything behind this announcement other than the launch of her new podcast? What's going on here, Robin? <laughs> I, w I was just about to say she's launching a new podcast and honestly I think this is an audition for her to get a show on on uh, look John she might be looking to you to, <laughs> to bring hey, her she's welcome yeah. she has but... she, we'd love to have Tulsi Gabbard uh, <laughs> join us uh, here for uh, maybe not a whole show but I'd like to have her you know follow <laughs> follow up with some questions of course. for sure I've got to admit to you I've got to admit to you I'm gonna get skewered by my friends on the left but I actually donated to her campaign back when she was running for president because she was a veteran and I liked se several of her policies. So I am sad to see her go, but uh, like Bianca alluded to, I'm not surprised. This has been a long time in the coming. And honestly, I thought she'd already left. So this mm -hmm. came as news to me, the fact that she's just now leaving. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, we have Jesse Jane Duff, uh, of course, as uh, well to join us now, retired Marine gunnery sergeant and Newsmax contributor. So um, thanks for popping in on this. So Tulsi Gabbard, your reaction to her quitting the Democratic Party? A lot of people say she's she's not a true conservative either, though. No, she's not going to suddenly join the Republican Party. Uh, she has essentially messaged conservatives. She went to CPAC. She gives a rousing call against Democrats, which is very popular. She's basically trying to cater to an audience that may tune into her podcast and give her a great platform. She won't become a Republican. She may become a libertarian, who knows, or an independent. But I do appreciate that she's calling out these woke policies that really are doing nothing for this country. She's calling out the fact that there is no religious freedom because we are seeing this pushback against conservatives and Christians consistently. Um, many groups that have been attacked mm. by the left have been Jewish and Christian groups. So here we are. Uh, Tulsi Gabbard is basically saying, I'm free of this. Now I can speak my mind. I don't have a political agenda for my own election, just a podcast. And I'm here to talk. Yep, well, that is her role today, and yeah, you know, she's welcome to come on again.